So here's the deal. MediaTakeout.com posted a story on their website recently. Actually, it was posted on February 29th, 2016. Posted on my blog on March 1st, the next day. And I didn't get a chance to make this video, but man, I'm going to read to you the crap that they had to say about Stevie J and Mimi Faust getting shot at, <laughs> allegedly. MediaTakeout.com wrote, and I quote, MediaTakeout.com just got word that two of the stars of Love & Hip Hop, Stevie J and Mimi Faust, are both lucky to be alive. According to multiple sources, goons shot up their hotel and we're told that they were trying to assassinate the reality stars. It all started when Stevie and Mimi were at Charlotte's Club Empire to celebrate the CIAA tournament. A MediaTakeout.com insider explains, quote, Stevie got into it with someone in the club. Okay, so pause the story right there. That part of the story is actually true. He did get into a fight. Basically, this guy actually technically assaulted him. He kind of sucker punched him, if I'm not mistaken. He kind of like hit him from the side or from behind or whatever. If you need to see it, if you don't know what the hell I'm talking about, say, hey, where's the video of you talking about Stevie J being assaulted at Club Empire? And I'll hook you up with a link to it. I posted it on my blog and whatnot. Anyways, <laughs> it all started when Stevie and Mimi were at Charlotte's Club Empire to celebrate the CIAA tournament. A MediaTakeout.com insider explains, quote, Stevie got into it with someone in the club and they had a lot of friends. Before you know it, a bunch of people jumped Stevie and Mimi. Pause the story. I don't remember seeing Mimi anywhere on the video, for the record. We're told that Stevie and Mimi managed to escape the melee and drive back to their hotel, the Hyatt Place Hotel. Both Stevie and Mimi suffered minor injuries. And we're told that Mimi's clothes were, quote, ripped off during the melee. But that's when things turned deadly. Moments after Stevie and Mimi went into their hotel, we're told that the same people that were fighting Stevie allegedly shot up the hotel. A van, which looks just like the one that Stevie and Mimi arrived in, was shot by machine guns. Here is how local media is reporting the shooting. They do not yet know about the Stevie J tie-in to. Yeah, and of course, MediaTakeout.com knows about it. They have the exclusive, right? Anyway, here was the quote from the media. And for the record, this is an actual quote from media because the shooting did happen, but there's no confirmation that it had anything to do with Stevie and Mimi. But the media said, quote, three men in town for the CIAA tournament were arrested Sunday after they fired dozens of bullets into two vehicles and an uptown hotel and were found in possession of an AK-47, police said. No one was reported injured during the early morning gunfire, which happened around 4.40 a.m. near the Hyatt Place Hotel. End quote. <laughs> yeah, so, yeah, these guys did shoot up a vehicle. I think it might have been a Mercedes Sprinter, or at least that's what it looked like. But anyways, here's what Mimi Faust had to say about on social media. Somebody named Sexy Tangy said, were you really shot at? And Mimi responded by saying, no, no shots fired at us. So Mimi is denying the shooting part of the story for the record. And I'm more apt to believe Mimi than media takeout. But when you look this good, like my girl Mimi Faust, I mean, how in the world could I not believe pretty Mimi? Remember when she was in that 112 video for the na 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 featuring Supercat? Remember that? If you don't know what I'm talking about, ask me about it in the comment section. I'll give you a link to the music video just ask me for the music video link but anyways i'm glad that the good guy slash creep stevie j is safe i'm glad that the girl sexy ass porn star mimi faust is safe too because she's a milf and there's no reason for them to get shot at in the first place i mean what in the world would they do that would ever justify shooting at them i mean it's stevie and mimi they're VIPs. But I love Steamy and Mimi, so of course I'm going to say that. Anyways, let me know what you think about it all below. Do you think this story is false? Do you think it's real? Do you think MediaTakeout.com is full of shit and knew that Stevie had nothing to do to the shooting? They just basically linked two completely different stories. 
Or do you think that those guys were really trying to get at Stevie? Let me know what you think about it all below. Be sure to subscribe to the Meat Magazine YouTube channels. Visit meatmagazine.blogspot.com and follow me on Twitter at Meat Magazine.